Lake Naivasha is a freshwater lake in Kenya near the town of Naivasha in Nakuru County. It is part of the Great Lift Valley Lakes. The name Naivasha comes from the local Maasai name Naiposha, meaning rough waters because of the sudden storms which can arise on the lake. The lake was once described as the jewel in the crown of all East African lakes. The lake is fed by the Malewa and Gilgil rivers and the seasonal Karate River. Malewa is the largest river flowing into the lake, contributing over 90% of the water. There is no visible outlet, but since the lake is relatively fresh, it is assumed to have an underground outflow. It is speculated that Lake Naivasha's underground outflow might be feeding the Geothermal Reservoir at Olkaria, which is used to generate electricity. The lake had an average surface area of 139 square kilometers before the year 2010, but that had increased to over 190 square kilometers by 2020. This was due to increased rainfall and surface runoff. This increase has been experienced by other Rift Valley lakes in Kenya, including Baringo, Bogoria, and Nakuru. The lake is shallow, with an average depth of 6 meters, and the deepest parts being 30 meters. It is surrounded by a swamp which covers an area of 64 square kilometers, but this can vary largely depending on the rainfall. The lake is home to a variety of wildlife including different species of birds, plants, fish and hippos. The economic activities enabled by the lake include tourism, agriculture, fishing and geothermal electricity generation. Floriculture and horticulture form the main industry around the lake. This has made Kenya to be the leading exporter of cut flowers and Naivasha supplies about 75% of this. Although the lake employs thousands of Kenyans and significantly contributes to the economy, its biodiversity is critically threatened by human caused factors such as habitat destruction through encroachment of wetlands, overharvesting of papyrus, pollution from pesticides, herbicides and fertilizers, sewage effluent and water abstraction.